welcome to Red VTV as we continue our build up to the 2023 Super League season. And with 13 days to go, everybody knows there's only one man we will be talking about. It's Morgan Knowles. It is, and he's proudly sponsored by Lancashire Fire Solutions, whose specialism is in ri fire risk assessments for social housing landlords and residential care. They were established in 2009 with experienced, competent assessors. Don't know where they're based, though? Lancashire. Yes. Good on him. Um... Morgan Knowles, the opening line of Morgan Knowles' profile on the Saints website says he is one of the unsung heroes of the Saints pack. Not anymore. You cannot. I think for years we saw him as the underrated, never spoken about, just got on with his work and, and people didn't really see what he brought or other fans of other clubs probably didn't see what he brought to us. That can't be levelled at him anymore. I'm sorry, he's gone past that that stage in his career. He is now a bona fide Super League great at the moment. When I say great, I'm not going to turn around and say he is the best 13 we've ever had. I'm not going to turn around and say he's the best 13 that the league's ever seen. But he is, as things stand in this league, the best 13. Yep. Right, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> um, yeah, and obviously it was it was right and just that he got to play in the grand final, Kev. It certainly was, wasn't it? I mean, it certainly was. Um, there was a, a, a an argument made, and obviously it was the right argument. Um, what more can we say? Hey, Kev, do you wear Mike Rush t shirts to bed? I do. Look at him. Lovely man. Lovely man. Thanks. Thanks to uh, Smudge who had this T-shirt made for the grand final for the loan for this one. Look at him. Look at him there. <laughs> um. <laughs> Where did you go from there? <laughs> There's no way to go. Um. We probably, as as we usually do, is what do what do you expect from Morgan this season? I think possibly. Listen, keep your tackling technique clean, like we've said about a couple of our forwards so far, because it just seemed like towards the end of the year he was picking up uh, a couple of citations and and potentially like picking up bands. Obviously, the big one got overturned. Um, but Morgan Knowles does what Morgan Knowles does. He's not a 13 in the likes of another great 13 in the league, Joe Westerman, who's probably a little bit more of a halfback than, than Morgan Knowles is. Um, he, he's not of that ilk, but he just brings that defensive solidity in, and that's what he's going to keep doing. It, it, there's no real, oh, he's going to want to add this to his game or he's going to want to add that to his game because it isn't his game. He'd have brought it. Now, if he was more of a Paul Sculthorpe, he's not. He's a proper, like, not quite a third prop, but he brings that solidity solidity of a real tough forward. Um, so I think that's that's what he's going to look at. Obviously, listen, he's he's first choice in that in that position, uh, and he will be while he's at the club. Um, I think his contract runs till the end of twenty twenty five. If he then went on to Australia, I think it'd be great over there. Um, but listen, we've got to try and keep players like Morgan Knowles at the club. Yeah, obviously he's contracted till the end of 2025. He's just turned 26, so he'd be 28 um, at the end of his current deal. That's going to be his it's the decision, isn't it? He's either going to try his luck in Australia for a year or two, or he's seeing his career out at Saints. Um, you hope, obviously, with him making his debut in 2015, he'll be due a testimonial around then. Um, whether the riches that, that that can generate help sway him into signing a new deal to stay in at the club, because obviously we know we like to reward and, and support our players, just as we've done over the last few years with uh, Alex Walmsley, currently Matt Percival, Tommy Makinson. Um, 
I suspect Morgan will stay at the club and I suspect he'll captain the club as well. That wouldn't surprise me. Um, I think when you, when you look like at, at leaders, he's probably part of that leadership group and he's still young enough to be a captain for a couple of years in a couple of years' time. That's it. You'd almost think that when... Well, I think it goes without saying, when James Roby doesn't play this season, Johnny Lomax will be captain. But you you need players like Morgan Knowles who do big stints in the game, in the forwards, to help that leadership group. Alex Walmsley does it. You'd imagine that Matty Lees, to some extent, does it. So having Morgan Knowles in that role already will set him up for potentially being a, a future Saints captain. Absolutely. Um, he's made 172 appearances for the club, so with a clean year and an injury-free year, he may hit the 200 mark this season. Yeah, and hopefully so. Um, hopefully so. It'd be a good milestone for him um, and hopefully plenty more to come in the future. Right, that is Mr Knowles done. Uh, Kev, I'm going to let you go and I'm going to let you go and enjoy the rest of your Sunday with a nice nap under the covers with Mike Rush. <laughs> See you soon then.